another day. We're back with another Funko NFT Legendary Funko Pop. I told you, I'm going to go through all the ones I have redeemed to show you guys what you could potentially get when you buy Funko NFT packs. I know there's still a lot of hatred out there for it. And honestly, I think that might be where I kind of focus a lot of my Funko collecting because limited pieces, super rare drops, overall, not going to say all, but overall, some really cool looking pops you get. And it's just fun. Me personally, I love it. I was in the sports card industry for the longest time. And I loved opening packs. I loved collecting my favorite players, my favorite autographs, my favorite jersey cards, stuff like that. I used to love doing that all the time growing up. And this brings me back to what I used to really enjoy. So let's get into another legendary Funko Pop. All right, so Drop has officially announced the Alien line. What you can pull, and honestly, there's only a couple pieces I think I'm going for. I think I'm going to go for that Royalty, and I think I'm going to go for the uh, Ultra. Crazy, I know. Those are the two pieces I want, personally. Anything else will probably be up for sale or trade later on down the, later on down the road. But since you guys probably don't even know that these NFT pops do turn into physical pops, Time to show you another one. Another one, and this one's from the Christmas drop. This one was from a movie that people love, people hate, mainly probably because it's overplayed, or they don't really like the main actor. But that being said, I enjoyed this drop. I definitely kind of won. How many did I get? I got one, two, three from this drop. I got three from this drop. I think. Yeah, I did three from this drop, and I got one legendary. And actually, it's probably... The one most people kind of wanted. Let me, let me look at the numbers real quick. Um, so, mm -hmm. uh huh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, it wasn't the most. It was your second least redeemed. And that could be for many reasons. That could be good. People didn't pull them, trade them, or send them in. Anyway, let's get into today's pop. And it's from the movie Elf. Everybody loves Elf. Maybe not like the Funko Pop so much because I know people weren't super thrilled with the pop drop because they were like, it's nothing special. So then, you know, Elf Pop, it could be on the shelf. It could be a common, blah, blah, blah. But we got one legendary from this drop and we got Ming Ming. And if you know anything, Ming Ming was originally Ralphie from You'll Shoot Your Eye Out. Christmas Story. So this is Ming Ming. Yes, right now I have it in a seven bucks a pop pop protector because I keep all my NFT pops in a protector of some type. Why? Because they're all limited. And if the box gets damaged, I'm not going to be able to find another one. And a lot of times, they're not going to be cheap. So, I always keep them in a 7 bucks a pop pop protector. So, check out 7 bucks a pop for your local pop protectors and stuff like that. They're really good. I, I ship everything I sell, too, also out in pop protectors. Sell and trade. Everything goes out in pop protectors. I will never, never not. Anyway, so this is Ming Ming. <clears throat> Man, my voice is going. So, Ming Ming, as you probably know, was also... You'll shoot your eye out. Yep. He was. Um, why is his name something? Post in the comments below his name. Was the eye right now brain blank? But yeah. He was in the Christmas story. He was the main child actor back in the day. God, I'm going to look it up. So when I have to. When, when I get the section out of the box. I'll probably have it in. So somebody's going to yell below. It's so and so. Yeah, well, I know. I had to look it up because I forgot. I know the movies. Man, it's going to bug me. Anyway, so this is the Ming Ming. It should have been limited to 1,600 pieces. There was 1,523 of these redeemed. So anyway, all you had to do to get the Ming Ming was pull, trade for that card. That card in your, in your inventory, in your drop inventory. Cannot enforce that enough. Needed to be in your drop account. Come snapshot time. Snapshot gets taken. You get a coin. The coin then is able to be redeemed for a Funko Pop. Or you can sell the coin, trade the coin, whatever you want. But it's able to be, re be redeemed for a Funko Pop. So, this is Ming Ming. I'm going to keep flipping this box. Because you guys need to look at them. Look at Ming Ming. Look at Ming Ming. But anyway, you guys care about one thing and one thing only. 
You want me to take him out of the box, don't you? You want him to come out of the box? We're not taking him out of the box. He's too expensive. I'm just kidding. He's coming out of the box because you know what? Price doesn't matter. They come out of the box so I can show you what they look like out of the box. So, when's the last time you've seen this box? Not surprised. I did pull this. This is the this and the Grail were the only two I pulled out of the uh, out of the pack. Anyway, okay, let's take him out of the box. Let's look at him out of the box. You can form an opinion on him when we see him out of the box. All right, so I did look it up. He was Ralphie from A Christmas Story. Yes, the main character. We all know who he is. Why could I not think of his name? But honestly, this pop would be fun to get signed if you ever met, you know, Peter Billingsley at a convention doing signings. I don't even know if he does. If he does, it'd be a fun pop to get signed. But here you go. Ming Ming is looking at you. Look at that. He has his glasses down looking at you. Anyway, this is the Ming Ming pop. He has his cup of coffee in his hand. His nice little elf shoes. His glasses. I like the fact that they put lenses in here and they're clear. So you can actually see his eyes. I think that is great. And his shoes are nice and shiny. They're kind of, are they brown? They look kind of brown. They look kind of brownish. They look like a brownish paint. Um, All of them is matte, except the shoes are shiny. And like the black up here is shiny. But he's completely matte, like reality. His glasses have a little shine to him. Belt, 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 belt buckle have a little shine to him. But overall, he's completely matte. So, let's look at, let's look at Ming Ming. One thing I noticed about some of these, though, is some of these are really light. Like, this one's really light. Other one's, like, super heavy. But this guy's super light. And maybe... But anyway. So, yeah. This is the only legendary from this set that I end up getting. I do love it. I'm glad I got it. I'm pretty sure it's not super expensive. Like I said, you can easily probably go get this, I would say, no more than 40 bucks. Probably no more than 40 bucks. I could be 100% wrong. But if I had to guess, I would say no more than 40 bucks is what he would be able to, you'd be able to grab it for. So, that being said, let me know in the comments below. Did you buy any of the Elf NFTs when they came out? Did you pull any? Did you trade for some? And do you enjoy these? Did you enjoy these Elf pods? I personally, I enjoyed them, but I think the set could have been smaller. My personal opinion, I'm wild out of my opinions, but I think the set could have been smaller. The most could have been smaller. But, and the grail, well, we're not, we don't, we don't talk about that grail back there. You can see the box. The biggest box back there. We're not talking about that grail. That grail's a headache. It's going to be coming out of the box in a future video. You will see it up close and personal. Person, wow, up close in the camera. You'll see it eventually. But right now, we're showing off all legendaries, and this is the legendary from Elf. So you've seen the royalty. Now you've seen the legendary. Let me know in the comments below. Did you buy any? Would you are you planning to go buy some? Or do you think these are absolute garbage? I was gonna say trash, but somebody else uses trash a lot, and I respect them. I really do. So absolute garbage. Let me know in the comments below. I'd love to know. But that's all I got for you guys today. So until next time, y'all take it easy. Have a good one. And I think I'm gonna do what he does and get a cup of coffee. Beats.